Belleville High School is in a town in Texas with a population of around 4,200. That's where Lucas Lickie grew up. One of his best friends from back home is NFL wideout Emmanuel Sanders, who signed with the Bills last month. Meredith recently had the chance to talk about their friendship with Emmanuel. Emmanuel, you know one of the members of the New York Yankees better than probably anyone else in the New York area, and that is Lucas Lickie. What did you think when you first found out that he had made the team? Uh, I was excited. Uh... Not only that, just just through uh, his resilience uh, in terms of you know right. being hurt and then battling back, uh, but also just to be a part of the Yankees organization, that's huge. I mean, we come from a small country town, uh, and the the chances of just one person making it professionally out of Belleville, Texas, is hard. But two of us uh, to make it, and not only that, like that was one of my best friends in high school. Right, we it was me, him, and my cousin Josh. We all rolled together. We played baseball together. We grew up together, um, and so it's just amazing. You, you, know, you kind of sit back and you think, like, what is God up to, right? Or is just energy, or is it energy? What was it, right? And um, it's just so cool, and 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 you know, to play for the Yankees organization, a top-notch organization, and now I'm in New York as well, playing for the Bills. It's just, it's just a crazy story, man. It's a crazy story, but you know, only thing I can sum it up to is, you know, I, I text him, I told him, man, God is the greatest, man. He's he, God is the goat, 100%. What do you remember about him in high school? When I spoke to him, he said that you guys never really necessarily spoke about going pro. Did you no, ever? And not, not in a million years did, did, did we ever think that we were going to go pro. I mean, we grew up playing little league baseball together. And I, I stopped playing baseball to kind of focus on football uh, my, w once we got to high school. But then I was able my senior year to – I just wanted to play baseball a little bit. So I went out and played baseball on the team. But I was I was really a guy that just stole bases. Like, really, that's all I did was stole bases. So, Emmanuel, I know your focus is football, and it's been a long time since you've been in the batter's box. But if you were, could you get a hit off of Lucas Litke in 2021? Uh, I mean, I can't, I can't sit back and say that I won't <laughs> because if I close my eyes and just swing, you never know. Like, I might I might get lucky, but I highly doubt it. I, I don't know the last time I swung a baseball bat. And even when we were coming up, like, I was I was okay at baseball, but I never, I never really, you know, took baseball serious as I took like basketball and football but uh I would love the opportunity just to sit in the batter's box and see how hard he throws though these days because uh man back in the day he used to be able to throw it like um and I remember even uh you know like Homer Bailey was from LaGrange Texas which was like 45 minutes away from Belleville and him and Lucas was like the hot commodities I remember one time I went up against Homer Bailey. He threw like a 95 miles an hour fastball, 98 miles an hour fastball. And, and I was like, yeah, I, I think that was the day that I quit playing baseball. <laughs> <laughs> smart man, smart man. Yeah. He throws correctly. He's coming um, way too fast. Now that you guys are both in New York, I understand you are much further north, but there's a good chance you'll wind up in Manhattan one day. Who's going to pick up the check when you go out to dinner to talk about two kids from Belleville? Yeah, that's, that's going to be interesting. But uh, <laughs> I think I think uh, we, we put ourselves in pretty good positions to, to even be debating on that topic is a beautiful thing, right? Two kids from Belleville in the Big Apple, right, in the big city of, of, of New York, New York. Like, uh, that's just amazing. And uh, I'm happy for him. I, I told him, I talked to him, I said, man, I can't wait until, you know, me and, uh, my cousin, we can make it out there and go to the game and really see a pitch. And, uh, just be in Yankee Stadium, man. That's gonna be that's gonna be amazing, man. Watching a kid from Belleville, right now he's pitching in the major leagues, and I'm extremely proud of him.